<laughs> Everyone anyway for more Slay the Spire. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, that's some good chocolate. It's the happy sounds of a man whose wife has a part-time job at the candy shop. It is just an amazing time for me. Um, yeah, the Watcher. We're gonna play around with the Watcher some more. Get more of these unlocks. Another reason why I'm not too worried about, like, winning. <laughs> this is just, we're getting points for the unlocks, playing around the cards, having fun. Another round. Upgrade, 1 HP, 2 random colorless, random boss. Oh, no, I like playing around with the, the coins. Even though a miracle, it doesn't seem... That's not that much of a miracle. It's a coin, but I still want to play around with it. Retain. How does the coin actually help us? Helps us... I mean, having an extra energy in turn could be a lifesaver. Yeah, I'll keep it. <clears throat> yeah. Obtain two random colors. Enemies have three HP. Three yet combats have one HP. Two random colors cards. Upgraded card. Upgraded card? Being an upgraded card. See how the upgraded cards do for us. So, Eruption does more damage. Vigilance draws three cards. I think Calm, okay, Calm, I think I've underrated Calm. Because it, it I think you can, because there's ways to exit Calm where you get the bonus on exiting Calm. I think you do a lot of energy card draw kind of stuff. You get tons of Calm, like, just, just cycle through forever. Wrath, the double bonus damage on Wrath is cool finisher, but I think we can do more stuff with Calm. Maybe I just upgrade Vigilance and we try to do more stuff with Calm, Calmitude. Maybe cheap cards that take advantage of the ability to draw so many cards off that particular calm card that we start with that we just upgraded. We'll, we'll see. Uh, one, two, three. We want lots of relics. Come see. Also, kind of interested in how the relics play. Even though the relics are familiar, their interactions with this character and their potential combo, their combo potentials with this character aren't necessarily familiar. Not a ton of choices, though. I'm going to go up to the left side, and maybe we should get an early shot with tons of money if we go up to the left side. Maybe we'll get a, a shop or something later. What is this, a garbage? This is a right garbage. I think what we do, we erupt on you. We eat you for 12. Hopefully next turn we finish off. They're not doing any damage to us, so we can sit in wrath for a turn. We are weakened. We're double weakened damage. Okay. And then he's just very dead. No problem. Cards are the favorite part. Is look at these cards. If the previous card played is an attack, gain energy. The previous card is skill, draw a card. I like this. It's almost like a free attack. Well, this is literally a free attack. It's AoE. Uh, having an AoE wouldn't be terrible. Well, we're going for more calm stuff, though. For more card draw. This gains energy, and we're trying to gain energy. Maybe that's right. I don't know. <laughs> I don't. I don't know. Give us the treasure, please. Is that max health? If we're at max health, you heal. Thanks for that, buddy. Thanks for that heal. It was zero HP. So I can strike, follow up, and then enter calm. We draw three cards. I can coin to a strike. I don't need to do that. But now we're in calm, so we exit calm. We gain extra energy. No reason for us to do it right meow. I don't think. Nine, we for 12. We can block for... We gain 2 energy, we can block for 15 hits us for 12, so I can, I think, do this. Without taking any damage. It was guys in for 18 next turn. I feel like I'm much more comfortable early in the game without it with a small deck. But then we get a bunch of cards, and then the deck becomes kind of wild. 4 damage twice. Empty Mind. We're trying to play around with this Calm stuff. We're trying to make, like, a focus on Calm this run. That's probably good. A decent choice, I should say. Hey! Okay, hold on, we can... here. How can I do this? Get energy, get energy, enter calm, drop three cards. And then we can't leave calm, I don't have energy. But I can't empty mine to gain two energy, draw two cards. Ugh, okay. I think first we... Actually, let's see, eruption? Hit you with the follow-up. We can then Miracle into vig into Vigilance. And now we're calm. I don't think we have a way to exit calm now, though. Oh, we can Erupt. And then not kill him. Oh, no, we gain extra energy, so we can't kill him. Oh, we do enough damage anyway with the one energy. Fine. Draw a card, reduce cost to zero this turn. Tantrum, deal seven damage, enter Wrath. He cannot exit Wrath. 
That, all right. Or just retain a lot of block. That's not bad. That's a lot like um, uh, the defect has a very similar card, but it's retain your little hand. Draw a card reduces cost to zero. So whatever he draws free, which seems what again we're getting a map. We're just gonna get a big sloppy deck because we don't play around with it. A lot of cards, even though we are kind of trying to do a kind of mess with this calm, kind of focusing on calm, also kind of just messing around. I think I strike, follow up, draw some cards, enter calm, we did miracle, draw two more cards, we get two energy back, fully block. Okay, I like manipulating these stances. This is, I, I, I do enjoy doing this stance manipulation. We can follow free, exit stance, although... Okay, we do draw two cards regardless. But it's probably better just to not take any damage. You only have to have 15. A lot of ways for us to do that. No! Fasting. Gain two artifact? Not bad. At all. Oh. Uh, free entry column is also good. Deal 7 damage, scry 2, draw a card. That's also okay. I think this is a choice of draws. Uh, gain 2 artifact, though. I like that. Let's play around with some powers. Maybe we try to play around powers instead. I don't, I don't know. Gain 3 artifact. 0. Oh, yeah. We really want that to be free. Draw 3 cards. Deal extra damage, deal extra damage. Yeah, I think I want this to be zero. Then we get a free play for the turn off that. Maybe we should try hard, maybe it'd be more interesting. Ah, I don't know, I don't know, I just wanna play, okay, we're just playing the character. Cause now I'm like, oh, now I'm getting all these ideas. I'm starting to get like ideas of combos to specifically go for, but. But I still want to play around with all the cards, so that I can't help to turn down a lot of cards, because that's how the game works. Uh, defend. I think we can... Well, we definitely want Fasting. Because he will be rude. So we can draw two cards. Shuffle our deck again. Enter Calm. I can actually... I think we can do this. I think we'll be safe enough to do this. Hit him with a strike. And the turn. Because so now we get... We do not get what I wanted. Which what I wanted... Of course was our... Vigilant Stent or Calm and get out of Wrath. It was, it was a risk. <laughs> it was a calculated gamble. Man, am I bad at math. Get energy back. We... Deal some damage. So this fight did not go well. This artifact, though? Okay, we enter Calm. We can then empty Mind, draw even more cards, get energy back. Now the big hand. We can't hit him with the Eruption. What's up? What do we have in our hand? Okay, I think we hit him with the Eruption. We only have to do 33 damage next turn. We're doing double damage. Our artifact blocks those debuffs. And now we can hit him hard enough to kill him. Okay. If it wasn't for that one bad draw, that would have been a good fight. Deal 5 damage. Whatever the enemy takes damage, gain block. Interesting. Deal 3 damage 3 times. On stance, change returns from the exhaust pile to your hand. Exhaust. This is very expensive. This is still very expensive. Add X smites to your hand, and smites are the retains. This could be really good if we have that uh, that power where your cards are cheaper when you retain them. Then we get a bunch of free smites. Especially with all the extra energy we can get. But without it, we just have a bunch of smites. Which is fine, it's a lot of damage potentially. Because each one of these is 20 damage. For an... I don't I play around talk to the hand though. And now I have to heal, because that, that fight went real bad. Went real off the rails. Strawberry helps our HP a little bit. We can go to this shop. Maybe better go to this shop. Let's go to this event shop. Take it a little easy. Free strike. Cannot eruption, that's suicide. Could, maybe should I just kill shield 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 boy. Uh, 
Okay, now you're gonna be dead. Of course helps us a lot. So when I hit him, I gain small amount of block. Block return. Interesting. Okay. And that's just like a permanent that is oh I think that's actually a really good card then. Especially if you can stack that. Like on a boss. I think that could be pretty good. Enter calm. Exit calm. So that's we'll draw like four cards for effectively one energy. Not gonna lie, it's pretty good. Uh, we just block here. Well, okay. Can't kill him this turn, he's a little angrier. Taking way more damage. <laughs> I feel like we're doing really well, and then but then I keep getting these fights that should be easy and they're not. But it is, I mean it is a lot of our deck just being everywhere. Well that is fine. Oh, that kills him, okay. Deal seven damage to each enemy, enter a column exhaust. That might be good for what we're trying to do. The enemy intends to attack, enter damage. Maybe that more calm entering stuff. I'd really rather be upgrading cards looking at these card upgrades. Remove a card, sure. Let's remove the... Uh, do we have a lot of defense? Not really. We have plenty of attacks, so I should remove an attack. Give me a good face. Oh, or we can just gain a bunch of money for this shot. I'm actually going to do that instead. They have a shop right here. 301. Oh, shuriken's really good. Okay, actually, I mean, we might actually get out. Ow, I just punched the chair. Okay, 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 okay. Establishments. Oh, these are good cards. They're fun cards. Gain one intangible and end your turn. At the start of your next turn, deal 15 damage. Is it? Doesn't seem that good. Can save our life, though. I guess it is a turn of intangible if we're about to die or something. But I do want to mess around with actually a shuriken and getting strength. So we're going to be, I guess, going for changing our deck completely. Maybe I should try to go for something specific now. Although I might just die because this guy has a habit of killing us and our, we're not really <laughs> that set up for anything. Calm, draw cards. Draw two cards, extra stance. We can now... Oh, hit him with the block gain. All up with that. Um... And then just hit him with that. Yeah, I should have cut their fate. I don't want to, like, waste the scry. That doesn't make any sense. In fact, I can just do it right now. Hit him anyway. Get path to victory. I want path to victory. So I discard that and drop path to victory, which I can then play and play. Even though our, the artifact doesn't really help against this fight. Okay, so we get free calm there. And then we just defend. <laughs> okay. I think I like this um, setup we have. Hit him there. We don't need to enter Calm already in Calm, so I can discard that Straw Strike. Follow up. We have extra energy. Hit him again. Let's gain some energy. Draw cards. Strike him one more time. Not to get any damage. We gain a little bit of strength. We need more strength. We need cheaper attacks. We need more attacks. We want cheaper attacks. More attacks, I should say. Okay. Simple turn. Well, I can never talk to the hand. I want to see that. I really want to know if that's tax. Okay. Hit him with that. We can then draw two cards, exert stance. Then deal some damage. Draw oh, discard the burn for sure. So I want to attack one more time to establish the bonus strength. But now, because talk to the end, we have enough block, not worried to take any damage, I can hit him again. And get even more block. Oh, this is a fun card. I like this block return. That's a really cool mechanic. Uh, get free energy. Enter calm, draw a couple cards. Wish I had done that a little bit differently. I could have got my follow-up done. Ow. We're already calm. 
can erupt. Get the energy back, deal 22 damage, and then enter calm again. So we got a bunch of damage, free damage. And we're calm for the counterattack. Let's draw two cards. Well, I maybe should have scribed first. Yeah, definitely should have scribed first. I shouldn't have even taken the Vigilance because I'm just going to play double block and then attack here. Follow. And then block block. Inferno! Alright, we only have 18 health. He has 57. Oh, no. Ouch. I do. We have to kill him. Here. Okay, it gives extra energy. Discard the burn. Draw a card. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. 18. Oh, no, we have extra strength. We're fine. Ooh, should not be that close, honestly. <laughs> uh, shuffle like through violence, which is a very strong attack. That's probably good. If the enemy has 30 or less HP, insta kill. When you draw us, add two miracles to your hand and exhaust. So that's just like a two energy gain when you draw us. I really want. This insta kill seems. I'm, intri I'm intrigued. You can no longer rest. That sounds scary. That's always scary. These are all scary. Uh, Velvet Choker. I think we're trying to play lots of cards. I don't think I like. Trust fill the choker. I'll just give enemies extra strength. We have extra strength. They run extra strength. Let's go. Can I get another shot for a couple of elite fights? A couple of good elite fights. Like a good pattern. Can I get a good pattern? As you, the, the perennial question. Can I get a good pattern? Don't like any of these patterns. Don't like any of them. Uh, I can go for a really weak one here. Yeah, I'll just go for this. Just weak. I'll just, I'll just take the weak pattern. All right. First, talk to Anne. Follow up with the follow up. Don't want to enter wrath right now. Gain the extra strength. Block some of the damage. Yeah, look at thorns. This guy's gonna be a pain. Also, I was wondering if it progged off uh, talk to Anne. Definitely does not. Center calm. Trust cards. Get a free card. Definitely want a fasting here to get the artifact up. Strike for free. Uh, scry? We can then enter calm. Well, we can't enter calm. I want to draw empty mind then. We can then coin into empty mind, get energy refunded. It's not attacking, we can just strike. Oh, I still just hit him. We just still hit him. That gave us the extra strength of Shurken. Safa. Free attack. Can I kill him? I think I can kill him here because we use eruption. Hit him with that. Hit him with the cut through fate. He's dead. Carve reality. Follow up. Follow ups. We have lots of attacks. Follow ups would be really good, right? That's what I'm. That's what I'm thinking. Oh yeah, we're going the weak route. Okay, let's open up with a scry and draw. I think I definitely want judgment here. So then I can fear no evil on you and then just sense kill you. Ooh, okay. <laughs> nice. Use our coin, strike you, gain some strength, block your attack. Best that we can. Fasting, now can we be relevant here? Empty mind. Draw a free card. It's a strike. Let's draw a couple more cards. Yeah. Get you that. Follow up. Get our free attack. All oh, the free attacks are dead. You're starting to get it. Gain five mantra, which is divinity. It's expensive. Gain eight block. The next attack you play costs zero. That's not terrible. Do we have expensive attacks? We have no expensive attacks, though, so that's. Gain eight block for one, which is just like a regular block. If I don't have, if I don't get a two hundred discount, gain three block. Wrath gain additional block. I don't want to be 
spending a lot of time in Wrath. Mantra to get Divinity can be a lot of fun. We have to play it twice to enter Divinity. And Divinity does not stack with the Wrath because it's a stance. Obtain to, it's okay. It's just it's just things a little too slow. I really want to play around with like a divinity deck. But things a little too slow. We're gonna maybe try to be a little more serious during this uh from now on during this run specifically. Yeah, let's pull up the judgment. Which you can't actually play here. So that was a mistake. And the skill not attacks. So that was the other point. I was just real excited about the ID of that card. Because now it's gone. So now I don't get to execute him. So I want to hit you with that for sure. Uh, center Calm. Get the free attack in. Draw some cards. Strike. Pull up again. You're not going to die, so I can't hit you. Uh, Miss Down's a block. That's fine. That's fine. Because I could have hit the cultist to block. It's fine. Oh, well. Too late now? I can still do it. Just get 11 damage off for one. It's not actually terrible. Draw some cards. Exit. Cards. Re enter calm. Follow up for free. Follow up for free. Get the extra strength. Get the extra block off. Talk to the hand. You can't cut through fate, draw a card, doesn't matter because they're both the same card. Let's take one damage, hit him. That double artifact. I like it. Uh, I don't think I can kill you this turn, so we're gonna strike, follow free, block all your damage. Now we strike follow up. Okay, we're on vigilance. I'm gonna hit you once and judge you. Nice, nice, nice. I'm into this. Exhaust and recalm. We have enough calm. Enter calm for free though. Is not bad. The previous card was a skill. Apply vulnerable. I can really go with our attack combos. We have some skills in here. Let's clear the mind or crush joints. Let's upgrade to clear the mind. It's gonna be upgraded to clear the mind. Cause I'm playing on the calm. Trying to get tons of cards and energy like every turn. So I'm gonna play that on you for sure. Let me follow up on that. And I just strike you and defend. Now we do take a little bit of damage. Hmm. Okay. So you're going to attack. There's a lot of. I think order is really important. I'm starting to realize the order with this character is super important. So let's draw two cards, get the energy back. Scribe. Yeah, maybe I should have scribed first. I'll grab Judgment. And I can get you in Judgment range this turn. That I did discarded Judgment. Um, <laughs> oh, my bad. <laughs> Because I was scrying. I was choosing which to discard, not which to draw. Ugh. What do we get for free? We get a free strike. Doesn't do much good. Entering Calm. Yeah, we can enter Calm. Just pro proactively. That was a weak turn, though. You'd be dead. So annoying. Because you should be dead. Okay. You get rid of... That one. And you draw the other one. Hey, he's dead. There you go. Was that, was that that hard? Um, nothing else to do here. That'd be appropriate to against the Mystic. The Mystic doesn't hit that hard. Tends not to hit that hard. Draw two cards. Draw three cards. Then gain energy back. I'm going for this because we have Judgment. So it's actually real easy to kill her. Okay, starting to really like this character. 
don't think I need that. Protect upgrade and retain 17 block is pretty good. Gain 2 block, deal 3 damage. Or free attacks when we have Shuriken. It's not bad either. Shuriken, so much card draw, it's fine. This is a bad turn for us, I think, no matter what. I think we... Fear no evil for calm. Enter that. We scry one. Don't want to draw the vigilance. We're already calm, so no. Hit you with that. You're down, so take much less damage. Then defend fast and keep our coin. Ouch. You're already in calm. So I don't have exit. I don't have exit stance here. Deal 8 damage isn't good enough. Do that. Do that for free. Now do more damage there. I definitely want to talk to the hand. We're scrying empty mind. Dump it. Hit you and talk to the hand. He flails against our artifact. Free defend. Not too impressed. Not too much to do this turn. Nope, just turn. Stop debuffing me. Okay, this is going to be a wild turn right now, I think. We're going to enter Wrath. Then I'm going to hit you with the Strike. Then Vigilance. Empty Mind, get energy back. Hit you with that attack. Uh, we can discard the Strike. We can follow up. Cut through Fate. We can get a... We're getting calm, aren't we? Well, you did have to talk to the hand because we got more. And we enter calm. And we just defend and take zero damage. Probably could have gone strike there, just more extra extra damage. We didn't need to be in calm because he's dead. We judged him. Found found him one thing. Another path to victory is not upgraded, though. Do we have a campfire? Probably want to heal, though. We are getting kind of hurt. Ah, we have two in a row. We can upgrade one. Let's upgrade Path to Victory. Actually, heal first in case something real scary happens in this next in this question mark room. Yeah, no, brother. Not messing around with that right now. I'm still learning the basics of the character. We don't need to make it that much more complicated. Uh, upgraded Path to Victory. Is that, like, what do you do? 40 or less HP makes it much more usable. I'm kind of into that. 40 or less HP. Really get some executes off. Let's go for it. It's like a 40 damage card. 40 for damage for one is very, very, very powerful. Oh, I can upgrade another card. Hey, now I can upgrade Path of Victory anyway. Okay, we just got much, much stronger. We're about to get a Relic, too, and then a shop. Oh, I can one-shot if I get Relic. Oh. Oh. <laughs> if I had... Let's draw a card. If I get Judgment, I can one-shot one of these guys, and it's not working. Okay, just play the whole thing. Maybe you could have speed potion there, just take less damage. We're not really paying attention to our potions, focusing uh, a lot on just our actual cards that we're using. Don't need vigilance, we, we won't follow up. It's free. It's just free damage. Yes. Judge of next turn gets us a free kill on these guys. Enter calm. Good, just fear no evil. It's dead. So you're hitting me harder. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. 10, get free energy. Let's try something. Let's swing for the fences here. Then that. Then that tests us the calm, which is fine. And we judgment you, you're dead. And I do take a full hit. And he always has one HP, but you saw what I was going for. He ended up with one HP, but you saw the plan. 
Anchors are pretty good. Fire push. We need to use all these potions. I think well, actually we just keep fire push. Brilliant. Retain. Gain energy for each turn this card is retained. That seems really good. Kind of slow though. I'm stuck for these slow cards. Melan Melange. Whenever you shuffle, you draw a pile. Scry three. That seems good. We could just get HP though. Adaptation. We do some. Uh, b -b -b stance changing. Stance on sale. I'll take it. Now I can't afford the. I'll just take Melange. See how that. See how the free Scry. How how I like that. Let's go for an event. Okay, it's this event. Enter Gong. Adaptation just on that first. Forgot I immediately forgot I had that card. Free defend. Did I have any scries first? I did have a scry. Should have done just lucky and then. Ah, it's a combo I just wasted for a reason. Fear no evil. Uh, yeah, I'll keep that coming. But I'm not to enter calm anyway. I don't have a way to exit the stance unless I do this. Then I have that. So we do. That. And I can judge you to clear that. And then go back into calm. Get a free defend out. Take zero damage. Miracle the talk to the hand for future block return. Follow up's free damage. Strike, strike. Got the phase dead. Uh, let's try. Let's see what we're doing. We have the uh, preserved insect helps here. We start off with the brilliance. That seems very good. Get that going. Extra strength up. We take one damage here. That's totally fine. We need to be able to exit our wrath this turn because it's going to hit very, very hard. Also, it's going to be really, really mad. I don't really think about this. About how the gremlin knob was going to hate us a lot. Okay. Did you talk to the hand? Did you have to cut through fate? I think we want to empty mind. We can do something with that. Then we enter calm, enter calm, exit calm. Enter calm. Draw two cards, exit our stance, catch your energy. If the last card plays an attack, I don't have an attack here. I can just kill you with it. Tained one turn. Hits me for five? That's fine. We can just tank that. We don't need to make him angrier. We have regen going. It's going to be dead. In fact, it ended this fight much faster, much more quickly than I expected. Don't need that. Get rid of it. This fight's about over. Or is it? Let's draw three cards. Oh, yeah, he's judged. It doesn't matter. Yeah, that fight was over much faster than I expected. Prostrate, gain two mantra, gain one vulnerable, add insight to your discard pile. Nah, thank you. If we were doing it, we had the mantra earlier, maybe, but we didn't, so no. Nah. Crushed joints? That's. We have lots of combos for attacks? That might be a little too much, though. Another follow up, though. We can just get tons of these follow ups and just shuriken like crazy. Vulnerability obviously would help with that because then they're vulnerable, so it's easier to, to do that. Oh, can we just. That's amazing. Uh, new favorite character here. Uh, discard that. Should I have to talk to the hand first? I was just so excited about. <laughs> I was just so excited about that judgment play. That's awesome. That card is amazing. Oh, really? I didn't. Well, he's dead anyway. Anyway. Swivel game. A next attack you play costs zero. I think I'm enough for that. Don't care about that. Xing our stance. We have ways to exit our stance already. Yeah, we're not too worried about that. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Oh, this is a really big card. I think. Right, I think we heal. Because we have a good upgrades. I don't know. I still don't know what I'm doing. You know, we're just, we're just kind of winging it, honestly. Uh, wish I could judge you. We talk to the hand, though. That's a great first play. I wonder if he clears that debuff. That counts as a debuff that he clears later. No, he doesn't clear debuffs. Does he clear debuffs? I don't even remember. 
We're gonna clear eruption because we don't need that right now, but we can pass victory into a free defend. Oh, what the what a big play. Turn. Maybe should have played. Ah, eh, we didn't play attack potion. Should we have one more shuriken stack? We could have played attack potion. Start retaining the brilliance. Adaptation. This is a weak, weak turn. Not happy with that turn. Maybe I should have attack potion there. Okay. Can enter calm for free. I think I'd do that. It immediately empty mind. Oh, exiting stance does count. Okay, that's good. Because when it said switch stances, I didn't know if no stance stance that if no stance counted. I'm good to see that it does. Let's gain artifact up, so don't worry about debuffs. We can just enter calm again, which also another card draw. The adaptation pretty good. Get him with that, get more block. Draw another card. Get more strength. Enter calm. Already calm. Show I think I messed up that pattern. I think I did mess that up a little bit. Now I get him twice. And then drink our attack potion. I think I want Reach Heaven for that through violence card. We shuffled in there, we gain additional strength. There's no point in doing that, just getting blocked. Just, just don't worry about it. Oh, turn up blocks it anyway. Why am I discarding cards? Why am I scrying? I missed something. Some card I played with the scry, right? Or something? I'm mm, I'm not mm, okay. Already calm, but do get the card draw, and then we have. Do I have exit stances? Do I have change stance in here? Yeah, I have empty mind. Okay, he's not attacking. Get him with that. Uh, let's vigilance. With an empty mind. Gain the energy back. My hand is full. This is a big risk because he's going to start hitting us pretty hard. But I think I want to hit him with the eruption. Hit him with the follow up. Not ready to be judged. Fear no evil. Gain the strength. Hit him with a they go through through violence. I think I want to save the brilliance for next turn in case he's about to kill me, and I need to really need to find a way to exit Wrath. He's gonna be for 51. I don't like that. Cut through fate might save me. Then with the attack first. Then with the attack first. You want to discard that because I need a way to get out of my stance. Oh, and Blanche is why, why we. Uh... Blanche is why we scried. Did I? Did I draw a card? Did I not draw a card? Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Did I not draw a card? Excuse me. Game. Game. I thought I was drawing a card there. Where's my card? I didn't get a card. This is a problem. Okay, so... Bad news is... Might be dead. I gained as much blocks as I can off the uh, talk to the hand. And he almost one-shot me. I'm still stuck. Okay, this is a bad idea. I'm still stuck. <laughs> Very much stuck. In Wrath. I need to get out of Wrath. It might, it might already be too late. Okay, there you are. Finally out. Finally gonna be out of wrath mode. He actually might just be dead because it's a ton of damage. Not quite. Oh no, he's dead, yeah. <laughs> so it's fine. Could have been not. Duplication potion's a new potion in the beta, for sure. Wrath under calm, calm under wrath, not bad. I wish it was retained. If it was retained, that'd be OP. Play all of the cards in your hand from left to right. Cards chosen random. Targets chosen randomly. Exhaust. That sounds fun. That sounds undeniably fun. Especially if we get a ton of cards. I have to take it. I have to take it. That's a fun. Lotus is also new. When you ever exit calm, gain additional energy. Yo, we're kind of doing lots of that. I'll take it. Sure. Donudeka. Again. These patterns. Uh, not great. I don't think we'll go here. Why are you all attacking? That's unusual. 
Okay, let's enter Calm. Got through Fate, draw a card. Uh, we want to discard Brilliance because I want to talk to the hand this turn. Talk to hand on you. I'm going to strike you. So I'm going to gain another block because for some reason they're all hitting me this turn. That's wild. Should have maybe used potions. I've always potions on I'm so focused on our cards. It's like when I first started playing the game and I never used potions. That's the feeling I'm getting right now. Alright, he's dead. Let's draw some cards. Just enter Calm again. Uh, discard that. Enter Calm, I suppose we just play that. And what a... Okay, one turn. Too scary. We can just kill him. I can't just kill. I can. I so I just judge him. Hoping not to have to do that. Okay, just hit me for a little bit of damage. Uh, why is this, this is the most aggressive spiker I've ever seen? Okay, let's just use a potion here so I can actually hit him. And then we can empty mine, draw more cards. We can just judge him, he's dead. Doesn't count as attack. We don't take spike damage. Another dupe potion. That seems very strong. Perseverance. We we had all these retains before. I don't want too many. I'm not I'm not going for that this time. Too many retains. An empty body game. Exit stance. Gain gain stuff. So we exit calm. We do have ways to be calm. Yeah, I'll throw an empty body. We'll try it out. Deck's too thick. We already knew. We, we were aware for that. No. No, I'm good. Thank you very much for the secret portal. No, thank you. I'm fine. I'm truly... I'm okay. This is a bad first turn. Six, twelve, twelve, twenty-four, nine, eighteen. Very niche cards here is making this very problematic. I don't want to erupt and then not be able to exit my stance. And he is here for 22. I guess we have a little extra block here. In fact, if I do this, we don't take any block. I get a pretty hit on. It's a very weak opening, but this is all we got. Okay. Scare free. Follow up. I draw some cards. I can scry for something or the strike. I don't care about the one strike. We're already calm. Can strike him again. Throw up the defend. And you know what? Let's coin to a fear no evil. We have this brilliance. We're gonna access coin for us anyway. Taking too much damage. Too much damage here. Far too much damage. Gain artifact. Draw cards like the stance. Free card. Free card. Enter Calm. Game block, X Calm, get tons of energy that I don't need. And then just take too much damage. Huh. <laughs> this isn't working. Um, there. That's very important for us to have. I don't need all that energy, though. Are we getting our butts kicked by this guy? I think it's actually a huge problem. Then I strike. Follow up. Empty body. We get tons of uh energy. I think I have a do potion here just to kill him. That was terrible. That was so bad. That was very, very bad. Alright, we've got... This deck's too crowded. This is a problem. Big problem. 
Uh, maybe we do need more card draw. Because we getting lots of energy now. Maybe we do need card draw. I need column and card draw, I think. Which, mean, which I have both options here. Exit, stance, enter, calm. Enter, calm. Exit, stance, enter, calm. Exit, stance. I think empty mine because we can use it just to draw cards. Draw, draw cards. Very scared though because we're about to die. Okay, we're calling for free. Draw a card. Don't. Okay, I guess we get to defend. Follow up. Defend. Defend. Judgment, you'll come back around. Help later. Okay. We're already calm. No, it's <laughs> too, too many cards. What have I done? Yeah, it's just, we have all these car we have so much energy. Oh, we have so much energy and so many cards, it's just we weren't utilizing our resources to actually do things. So, okay, that was kind of what I was thinking. I'm, gl I'm glad we had that that run. That was kind of what I was thinking. Also, we do need some potions, but I don't think it would help there in that particular scenario. Probably helped earlier in the other boss, or the other character, the other enemy. Could have fought him a little bit more efficiently, he had more health going into that fight, maybe survived that fight. But I am glad we had that run, because I was curious about if it's possible to get lots of energy and lots of card draw with calm and maybe just go like infinite calm stuff i think you can do it we just didn't do it the right way for sure we had a lot more energy than we had cards to actually utilize the energy especially with because you already start with the coin if you take pure water and then we had lotus for even more energy so we had so much energy but not enough card draw because the calm gave us a lot of energy we didn't have a ton of card draw the empty mines i think was a really good idea but not a ton of card draw. Judgment was a really fun card. I love that. We didn't even get a use unraveling. Never came up. Also, this seems like a really risky card because of you might end up in wrath with a scary enemy still alive at, or something. Uh, that that could be. This seems like a very scary card. But very fun. All right, we'll return. Let's see what unlocks we got. If you tell me I didn't even get an unlock, you didn't even give me an unlock. Rude. We were close to Dono Deca. All right, more beta monk slay the spire. Coming up soon. Really enjoying this character. This character is so fun to play around with. I can't wait till we really get into the strategies of how to play the character instead of just playing around. We tried a little bit. We, 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 we didn't switch to try hard mode to like floor two and a half. <laughs> so, which I've been trying to avoid, but it's, it's just instinct. It's instinctual to be like, no, don't take all the cards. It's bad. But when I begin, I really want to do that. I just want to dig into this character. We're having a lot of fun exploring this character. I love switching stances. I love all these really interesting new effects. That I like the auto kill. I like putting in powerful new cards into your deck. They then draw later. That can have a lot of synergies. I'm surprised Shuriken didn't work later. She has a lot of cheap attacks. Uh, we did kind of do a follow-up, but we just ended up without a lot of attack. We're, we're trying to do two different things. That's what happened. We're trying to do two different things. We're trying to do a lot of cheap attacks with Shuriken, get a lot of strength, and just cycle through attacks. But we're also trying to mess around with Calm and card draw and get lots of energy and lots of cards. And when you have two different decks in one, sometimes they don't work out so well together. So that was probably a big issue for that run. But so much potential. I love this character. I'm really glad. I'm really glad that they made an interesting character because they already had warrior, warrior, mage, thief. Like they're warrior, thief, mage. They already had those three archetypes. I'm like, wow, they covered a lot of ground here. I don't know what else are they going to do. I'm glad they added the monk and were able to do something really interesting with it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, share the video, subscribe for more fun on Twitter. Like Sneal. I'll see you guys next time. Your obscure compliment is you'd be a pretty, you'd be a wonderful monk. Uh, no, monk already said that. You'd um, this little this little flame sprite here. They never see anywhere else in the game. I'm not even sure why it's here. Yeah. Burn bright, brother. See you later.